if you want to my uncle straight to social media name for and some my echo so everyone and to us so liberian lady air trendy in a yeah i cry high court and i was sentenced a liberian national 10 years imprisonment for attempting to smuggle cocaine and a court drag through the kotka international airport to bangkok now the court presided over by her ladyship justice mary Ikwa yanzu on wednesday august 31st after the conviction of miss wolo mike play margaret also find her 10,000 penalty unit in default to serve three years additional term. The accused pleaded guilty to two counts of attempted exportation and possession of a narcotic drug without a Minister of Health license in violation of sections 36 and 37 of the Narcotics Control Commission Act 2020, um, respectively. Now, the presiding judge, however, found her guilty on her own plea on each count to run concurrently. If you want to no comment, I buy it in here. Mommy is to say, if she had succeeded, Anka, she would say, I started my restaurant business with two cups of rice, <laughs> with one table and a chair. <laughs> Adam, I say, KIA security is one of its kind. A friend of mine was returning to Dubai and decided to go with Gary, and the security was asking him for the Gary license. He was charged 100 CDs before he could go with the Gary. If not that day, I answer, A, never knew Gary must have a license. John say, in fact, proper investigation must be done to uncover those behind her. To all you know, it's someone somewhere that might consign her to get her percentage. This is time for security to exhibit their profession to unveil what is hidden. Obia a master. <clears throat> because we say, it was only last week I was telling a friend that narcotics arrest at KIA had gone down, not knowing a blast was coming soon. As far as she should have come back to give our kid sisters pressure, like the cassette seller, whose car is worth more than the net of all his businesses put together. <laughs> if one of my NCA air trending, a deputy director, consumer, and corporate affairs division, <laughs> and the National Communications Authority, NCA, Freno, Kwame Jan, on was the essential friend of Solon Solo, and uh, he has said that mobile network operators. Uh, they have begun blocking unregistered SIM cards since Monday, September 5th. Now, he said, said from Wednesday, September 7th, no, persons who have completed just stage one of the registration will be added to the list of those whose cards are to be blocked. And to be more, I'm more delay, so hashtag, no, and I'm more delay with more Ghana card, but more call it, and go capture more biometrics, no, and what's them in a year, can you see it, you more, if you're from him. Comment here by no AB in here. Joel say, What about we, the quick loan defaulters? Our sims are still active. Can you kindly block us quickly? We can't wait. Adam said, This administration has obviously lost focus. You are yet to issue Ghana card, which is the basis for the registration, and the so called SIM card to, 1, 000, to thousands of people out there in the last three months, and you are here talking about blocking their SIM cards. Daniel say, what happens to the deadline date that was given? Mame say, instead of you people to concentrate on how to import cards to print the Ghana card for us, you are thinking of how to block our SIM. Blocking my SIM isn't much of a problem to me. If it comes to the worst, I'll let someone register the SIM on my behalf. Owusu say, how can I register if I still don't have my card? John say, I'm checking my own if they've blocked this. It's still active, maybe a day second batch. Happy say, it's saving our airtime and data. Stubborn Academy School is still open. If you want to know, Chinese embassy, air trend, in a Chinese embassy has broken its silence on the recent arrest of some Chinese citizens engaged in illegal mining. In official remarks by the embassy spokesperson on the issue, the embassy said the Chinese government has always requested Chinese citizens overseas to abide by the law and regulations of the host country. It added that if firmly, it firmly opposes Chinese citizens to engage in any legal activities in any country and supports the Ghanaian government to fight against illegal mining. Sasso and uh, backing moves by the Ghanaian government to enforce its laws, the embassy acts that the legitimate rights and interests of Chinese citizens are fully safeguarded. I quote, we respect the Ghanaian side to deal with relevant cases according to the law. We hope the Ghanaian side fully safeguards the legit, legitimate rights and interests of Chinese citizens. 
And quote, these remarks come in the wake of the arrest of Chinese businesswoman En Huang, popularly known as Aisha Wan. Commenter Abba Enye, Jerry said, tell us Chinese officials since you came to Ghana, which legitimate right of a Chinese national has been abused? Very soon, we the people will begin to deal with anybody who thinks they can leave their country to come and destroy ours. Chinese or otherwise, since our government has proven that they cannot uphold the land that our forefathers fought and died for. Francis said, who brought them here? It's your citizens safeguard. If your citizens safeguard their legitimate rights, they won't go and destroy our lands. Elizabeth said, do they safeguard legitimate rights of foreigners living in their country? Moses said, what do you want the Chinese to tell you? When a Sophomore thinks that because of a loan, which they stand to gain some percentage, there is no need punishing a lawless Chinese woman. Prissy essay. Are they safeguarding our lands and natural resources? I beg, they should pack themselves. Charles say, are your citizens respecting the rights of Ghanaians? Abuse and violations of the rights of our women and natural resources is all we have from you, China. Who does that? If you want to know, Elambele, Abba News, no more trended in day in day, Asembe Nesi Wawa, Elambele, Divisional Police Commander, ACP Doji Hologi, has been interdicted. Now, you're interdicted on Monday, September 5. Two excavators via a CZA on Tuesday, August 30, by a combined team of members of the Elembella District Mining Committee and our District Security Council meters away from the Nkrofo Agricultural Senior High School for engaging in illegal mining. Now, the two machines, you know, however, went missing after two days. This is the Bakono Now, as I said, we have uh, the accusations and counter accusations by between the district chief executive for Elembele, uh, Kwesi Bonzo, and the police, you know, now, also, you know, a year district chief executive, you know, you are you know, meters away from the Axim Junction after he had attempted to verify whether an excavator being transported was among the two that went missing after the Elembele District Mining Committee seized them at an illegal mining site. And you know, they now, on am Axim Junction, one of my women said, Yeah, the excavators be a few chrono marco baby. Some more they call Kumasio, some more they call Kraus, some more they call Cape Coastal, some more they call Tamalio, some more they call Hill. And also, my mean DH, Namuko be some more excavators, he munya and wehe, and no, and I, a day, a coso no more, a chain. Now, comment Abba no Ebini, Martin say, Ghana, 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 why? Our leaders are superhuman. How many times we haven't had our police brutalized? manhandled and assaulted citizens of this country in some instances on flimsy excuses. What happens to those police officers? A typical case in point is Nkranza Edria, which has led to the death of a human being. Dan say, so because a DC was arrested, police commander was interdicted, and the senior police officers and Ghanaians will expect the police to arrest others. See no evil, hear no evil, protect your job, oh police. I think there are some no one to say ye. Accusations in Abba say I didn't know where you are. police custody in Sino almost suspected police commander. No, and a police commander. No, so I suspected DC, you know, and see a summer call by no. Now, Mike also say apparently the DC suspected that the excavator being transported was one of the missing ones and confronted those supporting it, transporting it. Police officers who are not in uniform then emerged to arrest the DC. I think the police have a lot to answer in this case. I think they are prosecuting someone's hatchet job. If you want to man, now Paul Adumotri sues Captain Smart, broadcaster and board chair of the Ghana Airport Company, are assigned so a year the head of touchscreens, Ewo Ghana Hanum, Paul Adumotri, has sued Blessed God's Brain Smart, popularly known as Captain Smart and Media General Ghana Limited for Defamation. Adumotri is, among other things, demanding. 10 million Ghana cities as compensation for the damages caused to his reputation following some comments made against him by Captain Smart on Onia TV FM. Comment Abano Enye. Klo Ghana say, all protocols must be observed. Full stop. Ernest Ohimei essay, the best news ever. At least it will take away, it will take him away from our airwaves. Felicia essay, the clash of stomach journalists. John say, Paul needs more money. Asante S suggests that I don't have time to go to court like I would have sued Paul for buying a common tree well worth millions of cities just to beautify our airport 
with taxpayers' money. In Tisa and a comment, you know, a buyer, aha, and a yeah, they um trending issues, you know, ABC.